Okay. I'll just put myself a few little notes here and there. Excellent. Okay. We'll put, put the music up there. You know what I heard? I absolutely loved. At the beginning, that was wonderful pianissimo. Wonderful. Um, you were very, uh, what's the word? Like emphatic with it. It's like, mm, I'm just going to bear down on those notes, but I'm not going to play them hard. You did great. Um, the only thing I would suggest, though, is before you start to play, don't, don't, you know, just don't have your hands on the keys yet. Think about it first, then put your hands on the keys and maybe count one measure and start. Of course, it's a little different with this because we have a fermata and all that kind of stuff, but in your head, think of what your tempo is going to be here. You know, da, 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 da. Okay, so I'm going to go one, two, three, four. <laughs> okay. Um, what are all of these dots? Yeah, staccatos. That's right. That's right. Staccatos. That means that every single note in this song, and I think every single note, really except this one, is staccato. So, well, there's a couple here and there. So, that means every note. Start right here, and just, just I'll stop you when I want to. Okay, go ahead and play it like you played it a second ago. nice, but I think we need more of a crisp staccato every single note. I'm hearing more of but more, we need more of a I'm hitting the wrong notes, but you get the idea. Okay, can you try every single note? It's just like ha 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 ha. Like you're just gonna every, every note. It's harder, isn't it? difference already. Okay, now we got that one covered. Now what we need to do, you know what these little guys are right here? This one, this one, this one. Yes, yes. So that means like somebody come up behind you and goosed you or something. It's like, oh, okay. You give it just an extra little oomph, just that extra thing. So you want to have a good. Okay, I may have overdone it a little bit, but I'm trying to make the point. You want to give that just an extra push more than all the other notes around it. Okay, try that right there. Whoop, I know I made you move. I'm sorry. Whoop, whoop, sorry. Let's do one staccato. Da, 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 da. By the way, your memory was really good. Memorization, I'm, I'm, I'm impressed. How long have you been working on this one? I did it for a recital oh, okay. uh, a little while ago. Okay, okay, cool. And then I did it again. Okay, okay. Um, I heard some good sounds. Now here's the hard thing about this song. It's the really hard thing about this song. And I think if we did this, it might make a difference. Have you ever used the soft pedal? Why don't we do this? Because notice it's pianissimo. This was a fabulous pianissimo. Then when we started here, all of a sudden it became more like mezzo piano, okay? Or almost mezzo forte. We want to keep this pianissimo. So one of the best ways to do that is put on the soft pedal. All right, let's try it at the beginning. Go ahead and put the soft pedal down. Uh, I know you're holding the real, or the damper pedal with this one, correct? Okay. Let go of the damper pedal once you start into this, okay? But you want to keep all soft, and then we'll come up off the soft pedal when we get here. Okay? Here. 
machine on that. You know. I mean, you're going, oh, really? Yeah. Yeah, try that just right there. You're going, oh, okay, super loud, super loud. Mm -hmm. Much better. That's much better. That's what you want because that's going to give it a big contrast from the beginning to the end. And also, I mean, it goes back to that pianissimo part. So put your soft pedal on just to make that good contrast happen, okay? Half time is done. Half time. Okay, perfect. I was just about to jump off it. Only thing I want you to work on a little bit is... Um, when we have these, mm -hmm. the, the two eighth notes, quarter note, two eighth note, quarter note, the rhythm's perfect. It's just sometimes we get a little lazy and not um, keep them all staccato. What I'm hearing is instead of I want to keep it all staccato. So just kind of work on that a little bit. Okay. This is a pretty song, totally different from the last one you just played. I mean, major contrast. So this one is in a minor key, so it's kind of um, kind of a little haunting kind of melody, but more of a reflection kind of a thing. And because you, you can see from the picture, it's footprints in the snow. So it kind of makes you think, hmm. So in essence, when we play a piece, we're telling a story. And we're telling the story about you can come up with a story. Is this somebody that's lost? Hmm, it doesn't sound like it, because if it lost, it would probably be, oh no, oh no, oh no. This is more like, I'm taking a walk and it's beautiful. The sky is gorgeous today. We've had snow overnight. Not, not, not here in Houston. <laughs> and it's like, oh, I'm just loving being outdoors and looking at all the beauty around me. Okay, so that's, that's just one idea of a story. You have to tell that story in the way you play. Part of that is with the shape of your phrases. Notice you have this little crescendo, decrescendo pattern. We have that happening a lot in the song. Um, we could do more with it. As you get higher on those notes, you know, you start on a low note and getting higher, make that just a little bit louder, and then as you're coming down, come back a little bit softer. Try just your right hand right there. Um, Now put that with her left hand. That's it. Very pretty. Nice. So you made, you made that interesting as opposed to keeping it all the same level. Okay. Good, 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 good. Okay. Now, um, this little jobber, do you know what kind of pedaling that's called? Mm, I don't know. It's just a pedal bar. <laughs> right? Okay. It's called overlapping pedal. Okay. And this overlapping is a real quick up down. Up down, up down, because you don't want to have any pauses in between the measures. Okay, there there is a method where you do have that block pedaling, where you do have some pauses. You don't use the pedal, but this one is not. It's supposed to be a real. It's almost like a seamless kind of thing. Start at the beginning, and I know that it's kind of funny to have you pedaling up down on the same chord, but so it's real quick up down. Okay, so. coming up too soon. Okay? Wait until like it's, you're about to hit this note. 
Cutting like one, two, three, oh, I'll say one and two, and down, two, up, down, up, down. Okay, try that, try that, okay. Better, that's better, that's better. That'll take a little work. I mean, it doesn't just happen overnight, okay, but yeah, you don't want to have that space. You don't want to have that white space in there, okay? Um, good, good, good. We'll see. That's what I'm saying. Oh, yes, a beautiful retard. Where was that first retard? Right here. This uh, Was this the one? I think it was. Yes, this was a really pretty retard. Yes. However, this one, we took a little too much. Yeah, I don't know if it's because we just weren't as familiar with what was happening because it's different. The right hand's the same, but the left hand was different than what you had over here. Mm -hmm. That might be it. We just didn't feel confident with that. Yeah, okay. We took a little too much. Popo means little. Okay, this is molto. You definitely want to have a big one. It's like, okay, I'm finally at my destination. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, it was just a little too much right there. Can we start right here? And think about, you know, your little phrases too. You know, really, well, not with that one, but with this one. Have a little more dun 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 dun. dun. Okay. Yeah, okay, I'm going to make you start right in the middle. It's your, you're not as comfortable with the left hand right there. It's crazy there. It is. So let's figure it out. See what's going on. All right. Like it is in the beginning. Uh, we're playing an E, a D, jumping to F, jumping back down to an E, and then going to your G sharp. All right. Do this. Play just beats one and three. Left hand. <coughs> just left hand. Go. Play just this note, just this note, mm -hmm. just just that first, almost. That's it. So go. Yeah, don't play those. We're just going one rest, rest, three rest, one rest, three. Okay, good, good. Okay, because you're going to go from line note to line note, so you're only going to skip one note. Okay, let's do that again. without the right, let's do the rest of the left hand. Let's see if we can get that left hand moving. One and two and three and four down, down, skip, step. Yeah, you want to go up. That's it. Are you good with chords? Have you done like, your cadences and all that kind of stuff before? Yes. Okay. One minute. Okay, give you a hint. This measure right here, that's an E major chord. This one's actually E7, but it's an E major chord. So if you can kind of keep, you know, that may not uh, may not hurt. Sometimes it's right it up above. That's a C chord. That's a C chord. That's a D, a D, an E. Okay, that may help you a little bit. Okay. Um, oh yes. At the very end, it was a really nice ending. But I noticed you, know, you played your last notes. I was like, okay, I'm just kind of slid off. Play your last notes and hold it with the fermata, and then kind of push into the keys and push your hands off. I know it seems kind of really hokey, doesn't it? But it, it's really, it's a, per, a performance kind of thing, but it also helps round that ending sound, okay? Uh, you wanna start right there? Is that an okay place? Or did I throw you for a loop? Almost, I can, uh, that's it. off and you push your hands off the keys and you're kind of just like this when you're lifting your hands you lift your foot off the pedal at the same time okay play just that right there push off and up at the same time 
Mm, you're still holding the pedal. Uh -oh. you wanna, yeah, you want to lift the pedal at the same time. We've held it forever and ever and ever. Okay. Yes, yes, it kind of gives it more of a round, rounded sound. Okay. Good job. Good job. Very nice.